Hello and welcome to a poker smith with some numbers. I am a smith and today I am super excited because I have my first return of graded cards. One of which includes a diamond and pearl stormfront hollow charizard. So I'm quite looking forward to seeing what that has come back as. And a lot of the other cards are just quite random cards that I just wanted to throw in for a bit of first time fun. I'm so excited that I have forgotten my coffee, but you know the drill. Go grab yourself a coffee, stay awake, stay alive. Most importantly, please like and subscribe and let's get to it. Okay, so here are my slabs still in the bubble wrap. Um, I don't know what the grades are. Um, and yeah, let's find out together, really. So uh, thankfully, they've been packed upside down, so I've not seen anything whatsoever i don't know what order they're in so i don't know when that charizard is going to pop up um yeah exciting times so i've used a company called get graded uh it's a uk based company they've been going around for about five years now um they're pretty pretty solid on their um on the grading it's pretty strict so uh, a lot of people will probably be asking, why didn't you use PSA? Um, I'm from the UK, I have a UK based company and I want to use other UK companies with my products and stuff. So that's that really. Um, yeah, there we go. And all right. So I don't know, maybe we should shuffle these a bit. I have no idea what's inside. We can just go through one at a time and see what we get. So I'll, I'll leave that stack there. You can sort of see them in the bottom corner. And I'll take one over and see what we get. Um, I've got a couple in here that I've got hopes might be a 10 and not too sure about some of the others. And I don't know what way round the, um, which side the grading's on actually, I've forgotten. So I will try and find something to cover up. I've got a, there we go promo card there so we can turn over see what card we've got and then see what the grade is so this card is okay so we've got the professor burn it it's a nice uh silver tempest i think it's a nice one to start us off with let's see what grade we get with this one hey 9.5 uh, and what i like about this company obviously they've they break down each one. So you got surfaces, corners, edges, and centering. And there we go, 9.5, mint plus. Pretty sweet. And the next one. So it's on the right hand side, the um, grading score. Oh, okay. Okay, so this is one I, I kind of hoped would be a 10. I'm not totally sure. Morty's Conviction sat there with his coffee, just like I usually am. That's why I sent this one off. Okay, let's see what we got. Oh, a nine. Okay. Yeah, I wasn't sure. I was hopeful it might be a 10, but nine, pretty cool. So let's see how we break it. The centering is 8.5. That's what I thought might be the uh, the factor in this one. A mint nine, Morty's conviction, pretty sweet. Next up, oh, Miriam. So, this is an interesting one. I think this is one of the ones I purchased individually to send off for grading. So Hopefully, it was a good purchase. Let's see. Oh, a 10. Our first 10. What a purchase. Brilliant. There we go. Not bad at all. I think I paid around £30 for this card. Not bad at all. Surface is 10. Corners 10. Edges 9.5. Centering 9.5. Pristine 10. First 10, brilliant. I'm happy with that. Yeah, so not only do the um, 
yeah they're just they're cool slabs as well i like the the black and gold it's the theme of my store and yeah just just cool local company for me and chimpow i'm not totally sure i don't think this will be a 10. I pulled this from a booster box, I think. So let's see. Oh, 9.5. 9.5 is not too bad. Pretty happy with that. Corners is the corners 9, centering 9. Edge is 9.5. And surface is 9.5. All right. Lovely. So, so far, nothing lower than a 9, which is, which is nice. So what's next? Oh, the Mew, the Mew. This was pulled from my first YouTube video. So I'm really excited to see what we get with this one. Um, opening Paldean Fates, uh, ETB, I believe it was. And we've got the Sleeping Bubble Mew. What have we got? Oh, 9.5. I was hopeful it would be a 10, but a 9.5 is pretty good. Here we go, surface is 10. It's the corners again that have let it down. A 9 on the corners. If we can get a closer look on each corner, see what's going on. Yeah, see what I mean? Like, um, they're, um, they don't, um, they don't just hand out top, top grades, this company. That's why I chose to, to use them. Those are... Be honest, I don't think many companies just throw out top grades, but people are always, um, it's always, it seems PSA is, you know, PSA is the standard bearer and uh, a lot of companies obviously will follow that. So, uh, I got a Venusaur. I'm not too sure on this. This was just a bit of fun. I had a Bulbasaur and a Venusaur from the same, from the same pack. So yeah, this, uh, Venusaur, uh, just a bit of fun really i had the venusaur and the bulbasaur from the supreme victors set and yeah i just thought just put them in bit of fun see what we get and a seven. Oh, yeah i didn't think it would be it would be great to be fair it was just yeah like i said yeah you can see the edges there are pretty white that's the worst one so far. It's a non-hollow as well. I don't know why I sent that off. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know why. I don't know why I sent that off. Bit of silly silliness, really. Oh, here it is. Do I put it to one side? I think I do. I think I'm going to save it. Save it for last. That is going to be by far the most expensive card. Probably no matter what grade it gets. So let's see what we've got instead. Sonia, another trainer. Anybody that's watched any of my videos, uh, I like the trainer for a lot. So let's see what we get with Sonia. And a 9.5. Okay. Oh, okay, that's cool. Happy with that. Close to a 10. I got 9.5 surfaces, 10 corners, 9.5 edges, 9.5 centering. Mint plus. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. And up next, we have the Skylar. Again, another trainer. As you can see, with a lot of a lot of my cards, I've sent off uh, trainers or supporters. You know, so let's see what we get here. Hey, another nine point five. Centering has let it down. So we've got surfaces ten, corners ten, edges nine point five, and the centering a nine. If the centering was a nine point five. Uh, I'm not sure how the grading works. It could have been a 10. I don't know if uh, you need more than two to be more than two of the um, more than two of the uh, grading card criteria to be a 10 to get a 10. But there we go. Oh, that centering was just a little bit off. That's a shame. But still, 9.5. So we have two left before the Charizard. So the Bulbasaur's in here and I can't remember. Erica's Invitation. Again, I think the centering is going to let this one down a lot. I have actually pulled another Erica's Invitation since, which I think is better to be sent off the grading. However, 
I'd send this one off. So maybe a, maybe a nine, eight point five. Let's see. A nine. There we go. Yeah, kind of what I thought. Uh, surfaces nine, centering nine, corners eight point five. Okay, and edges nine point five. Okay, so corners let me down more. I can see yeah, at the top, yeah. Okay, cool. Number nine, and then <laughs> the Bulbasaur. <laughs> the Bulbasaur. <laughs> Why? <laughs> I just like Bulbasaur, so I thought I'd send off the Bulbasaur and the Venusaur for a bit of fun. Let's see, 8.5 is better than the Venusaur. Ah, oh, maybe this one will just sit on my shelf somewhere. Unless anyone wants to buy an 8.5 Bulbasaur. Uh, so corners, 7.5. Edges, 8.5. Yeah, and then, yeah. Uh, surface is not, uh, 9 and centering 9.5. Alright, so the big one. The big one we've been waiting for. The Charizard. Uh, it's quite an old card. Uh, I was actually gifted this card. Um, so... I'm thinking it maybe, maybe a maybe, maybe a seven if I'm lucky. But a seven in this card is still quite valuable. So let's see. So it is the Charizard. Get a closer look. See what you think. Maybe put in the comments what you think this Charizard might get. It's a hollow, it's it's clean enough, but you never know with these old cards. 2008, let's see, a 7, okay, yeah, pretty much what I expected, 7, so surfaces is 6.5, corners 7, edges 8.5, centering 9.5, so excellent 7 there, pretty much what I thought, um, I think a PSA 7 last time I checked was... 250 260 dollars or something so somewhere around that mark cool so there we have it those are the my first graded slabs pretty happy with that all right so there we have it that is my video of my first graded pulls i'm gonna send some more off very soon and see what we get so thanks again for watching uh join me on friday as we celebrate the first year anniversary of blah how dare evolve that's the one yep june it came out a year ago so i'm gonna be opening up an etb maybe some single booster packs as well let's maybe see and yeah enjoy Thanks again for watching, obviously uh, like and subscribe, share and comment, let me know what you thought of uh, Get Graded as a company, these slabs, I think they look pretty sweet, I love the black and gold, uh, I love the fact that it says what they've looked at and how they've graded it and there we go, nice sleek slabs from Get Graded, not a sponsored video uh as i keep saying i just found local businesses that i wanted to use so once again thanks again for watching and i will see you soon bye